Hey guys, you here, right? Hey, Gene, Rockstar has confirmed the DLC coming out next week on their Rockstar Newswire post half an hour ago. And this is only just part one, so we're going to expect more in the next upcoming weeks as well. So this is coming out next week, right? El Gotten gains part one right off the bat in the first image. We've already seen this in a previous image a while back with a nice little sexy, I believe that's a sports classic with scissor doors. I'm not sure that's not confirmed yet. But as we scroll down, we've got another car with eight liveries. It's called the Enos Windsor. Looks very similar to the Albany Alpha in the front. Not sure about the rear though, but eight different liveries. That's pretty cool. I just wish they brought it for more other cars in the game instead of for specific cars like this one. But moving straight on to a new helicopter. We've got a Buckingham Swift Deluxe. It's nice gold wrapped. They're going for luxury cars, man. So that means also for weapons, we've got some high tech combat PDW. Someone already mentioned this a while back. It was leaked and it's confirmed because he personal defense weapon and hopefully that's available for multiplayer as well. Moving straight on to the Albany Virgo, man. This looks like a muscle car. Then again, it could be a sports classic because it says the classic lines. So it's indication as a sports classic as well. It wouldn't be surprised if it is. That looks pretty awesome with the mods in the rear though. Look at that. All right. Looks like the Albany Manana customized. So it's got to be the sports classic, I'm telling you. So here we go with the Benefactor Sterling GT and the Pegasi Osiris. All right. Osiris. How you want to call it, man? Could this be Could this be the new supercar that's going to kill the Zentorno? The Zentorno killer that we've all been waiting for, man. Possibly. I'm not sure what the Benefactor Sterling GT is. But definitely, I know what the Pegasi Osiris is. I'm not sure on the picture right there with the scissor doors, that's the Benefactor Sterling GT. Or, but I'm pretty sure that's the Pegasi Osiris because we scroll down, we guys, we'll see another image of that. Buckingham Luxor. This is another luxury plane. Looks similar to the Luxor, but just another version of it. And here it is. Finally, coming to Legendary Motorsports, the Pegasi Osiris. People are speculating this is the LeFerrari mixed with the Pagani, Zonda, Hayura, all of this, because we saw from the other image. But this is definitely the Pegasi Osiris. But I'm still curious to see what the Benefactor Sterling GT is. It could be this one. But then again, is that the same as this one? Because they show the rear on this, and on the front, they show this. But I think this is the Pegasi Osiris. The Benefactor Sterling GT, it sounds like a sports car, whereas the Pegasi Osiris sounds like a supercar so yeah this is crazy man finally a new supercar has been one year and two months i just i just knew they're going to bring out a supercar for the next dlc and here it is coming next week as well can't wait for that and then there's going to be a part two to this as well so there's gonna be more vehicles i hope so this is crazy i'm loving rockstar for this they keep bringing out these free content with dlcs and that's what we have to appreciate Finally, we've got a new supercar. I just hope it will be his Antonio killer and at least compete with it with his insane acceleration. Not sure about this. Looks um, looks very similar. See, a Pegasi. See, Pegasi is sort of a similar case to the Pegasi Infernus and the Pegasi Vaca. So it's going to be part of the Lambo series. But then again, that makes no sense because it's a bit of La Ferrari and the, uh, you know, Pagani, Zonda, Hayura. So it's more, it's, I guess it seems more for the Pagani side. I don't know where that's coming from. I don't know why they put into Pegasi. Like they probably felt like there's no other way, no other category to fit this in. But I'm really excited, guys. Let me know what you guys think of these cars coming for next week's DLC in the comment section below. And I'll be definitely making videos on this, comparing these to the other supers and the other cars that we're also getting with all the Car V Cars series bringing that back for this relevant stuff so yeah thanks for watching guys i'm excited once again i'll, I'll keep saying this but it's about time we, we got our minds refreshed with this game show you soon now good night peace yeah hey guys are you here right here yeah gene welcome back to my channel today i want to show you guys my gaming setup because in the next two months this will all change 